Girl, this story. I have to tell this story. I can't even read this. I got to tell it. I got to go by memory and tell this story. Why you can't read it? Because it's too boring to read it. Oh, okay. <sighs> this man has come out back in the 20... Diddy, you know, at, mm -mm. At allegations. No. Back in 2018. Mm -hmm. Not that long ago. Well, this is before all this stuff coming out with P. Diddy. Okay. This man went to Trump, one of Trump's towers, and broke in and was destroying the reception area. He took a flag down, put the flag all out, and had a gun and did a shootout with the police department. Oh, my. This is serious. Oh, it was serious. This was 2018. Wow. Um, all on police. Was not president then. Was yeah, he was president. Mm -hmm. um, and the Secret Service got involved. Um, he's running through the hotel, shooting at the police. They shooting at him. <laughs> oh, gosh. They finally take him down. He gets shot in the leg. Okay. Mm -hmm. They arrest him. That's what we're saying. Why can't they do that when they Well, if he's black, black, he would have been shot in the head. <laughs> But they shot, shot him, him in, in the leg. leg. Shot him in the arm. Yeah, yeah. Not to kill. Go ahead. He would have been killed on sight. Mm -hmm. But anyway, he's the right color. <laughs> so they take him into police integration. Do you know this man? First of all, he's from Africa, so he has an accent. Oh, okay. He starts talking about conspiracy theories. He's talking about the Illuminati. He's saying that these are people that are over Hollywood and there's a black branch to it um, called the Boule and they are ditties in that and DJ Khaled and he Rick was Ross. Just out talking about this in 2018. Person? This is in his integration in that little room when they talking to oh, him. Oh, they have videotaped of it. This is why it's resurfaced. He said Diddy hired him to have sex with Cassie. All the stuff why she would he say all that though if they got him for because they asking him why he's in well, he's trying to say how he had led up to that. They got he's saying that did he hire him? Um, he's a, a prostitute, and um, all the stuff Cassie was saying now that's right, it's resurfaced. She said he forced did he forced her to have sex with prostitutes? Who is he anyway? Well, let's hold on for a second. That's okay. why I said this gets good, okay. So everybody, the, the police are like, okay, keep keep going. Yeah. So he's talking about how they, you know, these guys, they're powerful up. They can destroy you. And they do satanic rituals and all kind of stuff. And um, so the police are still talking to him. And you know, recording him. And recording him and, you know, all this other stuff. And he's saying, you know, how um, he got, he can't really say too much because he got, he won a, um, they, you can look it up. He won a settlement with Diddy um, back in the day. Diddy paid him a million dollars. For what? Well, hold on for a second. This guy says Diddy gave him an STD. <laughs> and he can't go into detail about it. He made sign, sign something. But he can't he talk made about him, it. Yeah, but he made him give him a million dollars. So this guy out of Who the is this guy? Who goes shooting up in Trump Towers in Chicago? Trump and he Towers? says Trump. Or New York, was it? Well, I don't know which one. I think it was Miami. And they sitting down just talking to him and having interrogation and recording him. And he says all this. Yeah. yeah. And then he talks. He says, Trump, get a load of this. <laughs> Why did this not surface before when it had Trump in there? Well, Trump is not going to let this out. He was president. Oh, he says, Trumpster, I think, he says that there's this higher up, like the Illuminati. Right? Oh. You know, same as Kanye. Crazy Kanye. <laughs> now Kanye's look not looking so crazy. Cause everything Kanye's saying, this guy He <laughs> was John Doe, all we know. So Kanye's saying there's higher ups that's controlling everything, including the media. Okay. And that uh the Vatican is up there. Then you got Putin and Trump and, and uh, Kim Jong Un and the yeah, China, na, 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 okay. which is probably why Trump is like, "Hey, I'm in this group. Get me back in office. <laughs> <laughs> I got connections. I want to keep my connections. Maybe he's not wrong when he says I can end that war <laughs> in one day." 
Wow. Get me in office and that war with Putin is over in one day. <laughs> What else did this man well, say? Well, if they're in these higher uppers, uh, maybe Trump is right. Get me up there. We'll have one of these secret satanic meetings <laughs> and all of that stuff will be squashed in one day. Okay. But anyway, so this guy's talking and they think he's just crazy. Okay. But then years later, we're hearing Kanye and we're hearing Kay Cassie and we're hearing all these other people like say, confirmed. this guy's, this Pit P. Diddy dude, he's in the higher ups. Okay? Now, he says Rick Ross and Khaled and all of them are all under the same umbrella. These guys are, they're big, powerful guys. They could destroy you, you know? They're all in this thing together. They're all gay. Exactly. And Back in the mafia days, they would have the mafia work with the other families of other color, other ethnicities, remember? So there were mafia high level and blacks or Asian, they would tie into right. the mafia as well. Now, so it's almost like that. When this video surfaced a few days ago, everybody's on the internet trying to find this guy. This, this man here? Yeah. He's not in jail anymore? Well, hold on for a second. He's listed in jail. But... He's not physically there. He's, well, he's also listed with some obituaries. Ooh. So is he gone? Is he in jail? Now people are saying, you listed him in jail, but we don't know where he is. We, you won't physically let us see who this guy is. Mm. Is this guy alive or not? He got a million dollars. He can go anywhere. He may be out of the country. We don't or know. Or they may have given him cement shoes. They may have put some cement shoes on him. Now. Because he knows too much. Do I believe in the Illuminati? Why would we call it Illuminati? It reminds it's a me group. of the pizza place. It's a like. group. It's like um, a group of people who control everything that's going on, the economy, the press, pretty much us. It's almost like the Matrix. They control the matrix. Here's the thing that I think that there probably could be some groups that exist that has that much power. Maybe not as, but as, I guess me as a person of faith, I don't care. Even if it is, so what? God is bigger than exactly. Illuminati. He cre he he's the reason why this Illuminati <laughs> is even breathing. Think about that. Yeah, you got the the life power of life and death is in his hands. The king's heart is in your hand. Even though you could be onto something. There could be P, P. Diddy is a part of it, Trump, all of them, mm -hmm. big names. Even your people like um, Elon, what is it? Elon, Elon Musk. Elon and all of them. Because they're going to get the richest people right. and tap into them if they could because they got the resources. Well, um, Emerald says people are coming out of the woodworks about Diddy. Everything is so scandalous. And Wendy says complexion for the protection. Oh, about him getting shot. <laughs> And like Emma says, oh, my goodness, I believe that they do exist. <laughs> Complexion <laughs> for the protection. Woo, that's funny, because they just shot him in the, in the leg. leg. And where is he? Is he outside? <laughs> Downstairs. <laughs> well, so I bring that up. To because say, that brings up. My sister told me this the other day. I don't watch the news like she does, YouTube-wise. I went, ah! it was funny because when she brought it to me, the old accusation with T.D. Jakes and P. Diddy, I was listening to a sermon. <laughs> I was getting inspired. Now, let me say this. By T.D. Jakes. And you know what? I still got inspired. All right, let's just say this. Let's go on record on saying this. Yeah. The same record I went on was saying with Tyler Perry mm -hmm. that I don't. I would like to believe that it's not, that that's not yeah, Tyler that Perry didn't violate with the Christian dude. Yeah, I'm going to say the same thing with T.D. Jakes. I would like to believe that the the, the connection between T.D. Jakes and Ooh. Diddy is very surface. Diddy probably came to him as a, a spiritual leader, mm -hmm. and he counsels him. Mm -hmm. um, whether well, they Diddy, showed him at the party, right? Yeah, some yeah, I, I or believe, whatever that was. Right. I don't know. Allegedly, so I, he might be friends with Diddy on a surface level with the party, but he doesn't go to the party parties. Now, 
There are people who are saying T.D. Jakes goes to the party parties, which is him with men and all this other stuff. Mm -hmm. And Diddy has Tate and Kim Porter had video. And that was one of the reasons why Diddy had to get rid of her. Mm -hmm. That's all been speculation. Mm -hmm. I'm going to treat this the same way. Like I said, I'm going to treat the the Tyler Perry Mm -hmm. thing. We're going to treat this like we treat any other Anything. situation. Let's say it's true and let's say it's not. Mm-hmm. Now, let's say it's not true. You guys got to stop running with this story that T.D. Jakes is sleeping with men and all this other stuff. Because the Bible says, touch not my anointed, neither do my prophet any harm. Mm-hmm. And in my opinion, if you are spreading rumors mm-hmm. against a man of God, mm-hmm. and they're not true, mm-hmm. I don't want to be on the other side of that. Even if they are true. We got to be careful That's with that. I, t- I keep telling you guys. Because you couldn't touch to David. No, and no, no. I'm saying in the Bible. No, no. David didn't touch Saul. You couldn't touch Saul. Saul was trying to kill him. Hey, and they trying to, he trying to kill me. No. I ain't touching him. No, no. And Let people God came to David. And him. people came to David. Aren't you going to take care of this? That man is scandalous. David Saul said, can kill, kill 10,000. David kills 20,000. You know why I think David thought like that? Because David had Bathsheba's husband killed. And David probably was like, as much as I've done, I'm not saying nothing. God will get him. He got me. Well, we no, him. I'm saying David. No, I'm saying in his life. Oh, okay. God got me. He said, oh, wait a minute. You're right. He was later on was be- king. So he's a whore. Saul David was the one. That's worse. That means he did it after he That's saw it. That's why the prophet of God had to say, <laughs> hey, what would you do with a man who took a lady, a, a no, wife No, say the whole story. Who's the prophet? I forgot the prophet that came to him. Oh, go ahead. But when the prophet of God came to David and, and gave that scenario of what David did. So this day, no, let's bring it. Uh, let's, I'll get rid no, of no, him. Let's say it in, such a man as you. Let's say it in today's, the, today's thing. What? You're T.D. Jakes. Okay. Uh huh. What would you do? I'm a prophet coming to you. Mm-hmm. What would you do, Jakes, if there was a man who was who knows who is who preaches the word of God, and millions of people follow him, but he's having sex parties with men, and he feels like because nobody knows about it, it's okay. Do you think that that man should still preach the word of God? I think he should definitely sit down because there's some healing that's needed and mm-hmm. some deliverance mm-hmm. because he, God is entrusting him to feed his sheep and to take care of them. But he knows if there's a struggle mm-hmm. that's keeping him in his relationship with God, where he's not breaking, when he's not offending God as mm-hmm. towards God's laws and God's over him as a leader, he should sit down. And such, get some healing. Such the, such a man as you. Ooh. You need yeah, to sit down. You're right. That's the moment. You need to sit down. Every minister that we know of that has had mess, they had an opportunity when it when they were faced with the mess, the man in the mirror. What you do after that? Some of it's them still continue do. on. It's what you like. Do. Nothing happened. That's my thing. You know what? You hit it right on the head. Let's say this. What? It's the same thing with the Tyler Perry. Mm-hmm. I don't even care unless you, there's some things I'm, I don't care if you say you, anything you did with a kid or mm-hmm. anything like or that. Senior. Or senior. No. Yeah. But let's say all these accusations is true or whatever. To me, it's how you handle it when it comes out. Mm-hmm. How you respond. If you say, I am the lowest, I am disgusting, I, it is something that I battle with, mm-hmm. I need help, I am I sorry, am Lord. sorry, you don't need to do the whole um, Jimmy Swagger, no, this. no, he could, they could do what David wrote after he messed up, I am going to sit down, and take your spirit from me, I'm going to sit down, cast me not away. I'm going to get under the ministry. Some I'm going to allow uh, men and women of God I'm sorry, Lord. to lay hands on me. Forgive me. I'm going to allow them to help me get this spirit, whatever this Creating is. Creating me a clean heart. 
I'm going to get someplace and I'm going to get with God. He knew a right spirit in me. Because he entrusted millions of people with me. Yes. And I'm wrong. I did wrong. I messed up. Now, you're going to still have people that's going to be like, get out of here. I hate you. Like they did with Carlton Pearson. Yes. But then you're going to have a lot of people. You go to hell? Really? Then you're going to have a lot of people who will say, I like how you you did that. How you responded. Yes. Yes. Now. Like David did. David could have very well said, I would have if such a man as you. Well, <laughs> I'm a king. I and what can do what I say? want to do. After the prophet said, such a man as you, David, what did David he say? He wept. He was he so cried. sorrowful. Oh, that was me. You're right. I messed up. Lord, I messed up. Oh, my God. And this is pre-social media days. Yeah. That's how he knew it was God. Because God told him the prophet. Mm-hmm. God will reveal. You ain't got to worry about what's done in the dark. Mm-hmm. Will always come to life. And we know because we all have been born in sin and shaped in iniquity. Our flesh is messy. Yeah. It's it's nasty. It it always desire, always craving for mess and dirt and filth. That's why Jesus came. Yeah. So I do understand, God forbid, if these allegations are true with T.D. Jakes. Kim and I always say. I don't put nobody on no pedestal. We don't. But. God will use a jack ass. You know why people don't realize that to get his word okay. out. Okay. He said, I I I I'll do with you later, but right now my people are hurting and are suffering, and you got a gift that I want to use, Bishop. This is a remote control. Can't see it on the thing. Okay. <laughs> we got this stupid background. The book, you can hide the book and um, <laughs> we have got to stop putting people on pedestals. Yeah. God would use a can of paint. Yes, he will. He loves us so much. And you have got to stop making these people as if they mm-hmm. don't have lives mm-hmm. outside of mm-hmm. when they step off that, that they're stage. They're perfect. They're not perfect. They might even be horrible. Did I I told you the porn industry mm. says that the most money they make <laughs> on streaming mm-hmm. Is doing Christian conventions. Conventions. Mm-hmm. Christians. So when you in that hotel room. Let me take a peek. <laughs> and you you turning on porn. Mm-hmm. And you think nobody knows what you're doing. Mm-hmm. That room is connected to your name. <laughs> and your account. And, and your account. Mm-hmm. So, and even that or whatever. Your, your um, address. Your IP address. Your internet address. Mm-hmm. Your phone. Anything. If people want to get masks on you, they can. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Skeletons, they'll pull it out and use it against you. But it doesn't mean that the stuff that you're saying is not true. If you really is preaching the word of God. we quit, That's the scary part of it. We quit to throw the baby and the bathwater out. No, but that's the scary part. Mm-hmm. Is the word is true. They're still anointed to preach that word as a teacher, as a as a prophet. But the world as doesn't a deacon. The world a, doesn't see it like that. They see it as for some reason the word of God is attached to that person. Mm-hmm. It's not. Think of it like think of it as school science. If I'm a science teacher and I say H two O is water, right? Mm-hmm. And I'm a disgusting human being. <laughs> and I use water to drown people and do all kind of stuff. It's still H2O. Still water. <laughs> still H2O. Well, that's why we say the word is the word. Eat the meat, spit the bones out. Exactly. Understand if that leader is messy, God will deal with him. He'll I it. do understand the witness is and, and it messes it up. It because there's a lot of baby Christians or people who are not really understanding mm-hmm. that will turn away from the like, church. Oh, he's not living what he's preaching. yeah because they're gonna say these ministers are all the same. They're all the same. They want your money. They they cheat on the wives and the family and. Oh, okay. We were perfect agree. people. I agree. There'd be no reason for Jesus to come if all our ministers were perfect. So let's hope my same hope yeah. that I am for Tyler Perry. Yeah. I'm hoping for, for TDJ. And this whole thing with P. Diddy. 
Yeah. But isn't it something that man in 2018 came out and said all of that? I know. And now in 2023, we all hear it. And he it. was recorded saying it. He was recorded. So it's recorded him for him saying what he said. In the police He's confirming P. Did, the, the girl with P. Diddy. Yeah. And other things. Yeah. Wow. Um, Emma says, oh, my goodness. Oh, oh, I believe it exists. Okay. The Illuminati. Yeah. All right, y'all. The verdict is in. We will see. <laughs>